Jeff, you weren't lying. Coming down sideways, a big play, that figures. We always hunt in the worst weather, don't we? All right, just be there a little bit as long as uh, something bad happens on the road here. Well, ladies and gentlemen, sorry I didn't get this on live dig, but uh, I got Jeff Firefighter long 43 with me today. He got it on live dig, for, so it'll be on his video when it comes out. I'm not sure what it's going to be titled, but I just had a... Uh, Oh, it was like a 1248. Uh, jumped up to a 49 one time. I dug really. I mean, I dug down there. I mean, I was deep. I was probably. I mean, the shovel was clear into the hole right here. I was a good 12 inches, and I, it ended up being in the bank right here, about seven inches deep. I just about backfilled this hole and walked away from it. I just about walked away from my first ever barber half. Let me get the macro on and I'll show you guys. All right, there it is. 1897 barber half. And uh, it's got the old mint mark. It's up here snowing, man. Uh, at least the snow came in from good for one thing. I needed to melt some snow on my hands and get some water to clean it off. But this is cool. Jeff's got himself an Indian head. He's He's having a hard time getting a date off of it right now. He's going to clean it up better. But And he's also got himself a buffalo nickel. Uh, we were just about ready to give up on this little area and move on to a different part where I've had better luck. But these coins seem to be older in this section of the uh, property. So we're going to hang out back here and we're going to keep looking. Dang it. I knew I should have filmed this one. It sounded high enough. Got a piece of silver here. <clears throat> Rosie. Not quite as old as the other one. 1964. Last year though. We'll take her. Keep going now. Well I got the camera on. We got that uh I got that barber half cleaned up a lot better here. Let me switch over to Mac to give you guys a better view. Alright, there it is. Cleaned up. 1897. It's got an old mint mark. Like I said, I'm going to try and put a link up to Jeff's video where he's got me on uh, pretty much a full dig on this, on that barber half there. Alright, this is uh, silver number two. We're going to keep going and see what else we can do. I'm getting everything covered in mud. <clears throat> this one sounds high enough. It gives me a 1344 and it sounds nice and high. Fairly deep. We'll see if we need this one's silver. See one staring at me. Oh, it's a penny. Seeing something green. Where'd it go? There it is. Memorial penny. Alright, keep going. Well, there's my first weed of the day. Fair, but get. I get that on film too since 1949. Weird thing is it came in like a quarter, but I haven't checked the rest of the dirt pile yet either. All right, guys, back on, back on another silver here. Mark, she's about I don't know about five inches deep. Kind of came in like a quarter, but it looks like it's 1941. I'm going to get her cleaned up and show you at the end of the video. We're going to keep going. I think Jeff's got three silver so far today, too. He's got a couple rosies and a Merc, too. Keep going. Alright, before my battery dies, not too far from that Merc. i got a nice deep quarter tone here. We're going to try and get this one on live dig. It might be clad, but it looks like it's fairly deep. So, let's see what happens here.
All right, well, slid the plug over to get, get it out of my way, and laying right here in the grass is the culprit. Let's take another Merc. Uh, 1941, sorry, I got that off the film there for you. But, uh, yeah, Jeff seen me filming, so he came over and... Hey, okay, nice job, Tim. Thanks, Jeffrey. We're gonna, how many you got now? I got three silver and 13 wheats of Indian and a buffalo. <laughs> right on, man. All right, we're gonna keep on when daylight's burning. Damn it.